I hate saying goodbyes. Well, it's not really goodbye. Life hasn't always been easy for you, Alex, and it looks like things are going to get even more complicated from here on out. You never planned for your sister Haley to join the Greenhouse Academy, but she ended up being recruited by the Ravens, and you were on opposite teams for way too long. But choosing between your sister and your clubhouse was the least of your worries. We love Netflix tween drama series Greenhouse Academy, but we couldn't help but notice that some scenes don't always add up. From Brooks recasting to basketball game interruptions to questionable school curriculums, we've got all the show's loose ends lined up for you. Keep watching to find out why the bomb debacle at the end of season two just didn't make sense. Well, don't just stand there. Don't you have preparations to do? The Break-In In Season 1, Episode 2, Judy hires Kyle to delete files off of Carter Woods' computer. Carter is sleeping on the couch during the home invasion. Carter doesn't blink an eye when the intruder points a flashlight into his face, and he doesn't move a muscle when Kyle drops a picture frame right at his feet. But Carter does wake up when Kyle closes the front door on his way out. That doesn't make much sense now, does it? No need to brag. In that very same episode, Kyle meets up with Judy in an underground parking garage. Judy seems impressed that Kyle deleted all the files while Carter was fast asleep a few feet away from him. Kyle brags about his credentials. Don't underestimate me. I'm a professional. It's almost like he forgot that he dropped a frame and almost got busted. Nice one, Kyle. School curriculum. You would think that a special boarding school designed to groom future leaders would have a very impressive curriculum. But in Season 2, Episode 2, we find out that the students are still struggling to learn slope in math class. Aren't the students supposed to be like 17-year-old geniuses or something? Jackie's Sketchbook When Max accidentally spills something on Jackie's bag, he ruins her notebook. But instead of fessing up and offering to repair it, he takes it out of the trash and sneaks off with it. We couldn't help but chuckle at this scene. Max took the notebook from the trash and hid it under his shirt in the most obvious way possible. Fake Medication In Season 1, Episode 3, Brooke catches Daniel drinking something strange out of his locker. She steals one of her dad's keys to open Daniel's locker at the end of the episode. And it turns out that Daniel is taking swigs from a painkiller bottle. The medication is labeled Ibuplifsin, which doesn't really exist in real life. This this scene didn't make a lot of sense, and what's worse is that Brooke's father, who is the headmaster of Greenhouse, doesn't do a good job at keeping his keys locked up. The Train Game Suzanne McGill has a funny way of teaching her students at the Greenhouse Academy, but if there's an exercise that had us laughing in no time, it was the train game. Suzanne gave her students the choice of letting a train crash into a stalled car on the tracks. It's going to crash into the car and kill everyone who sits in it. Killing five innocent people or redirecting the train into a brick wall, killing 20 passengers. The students were asked to make a decision, but we couldn't help but wonder why the people in the car simply didn't exit it. To make matters worse, they were in a convertible. Different Handwriting In Season 1, Episode 10, we find out that Ryan has been keeping a secret from Carter for years. She left him a letter in case she didn't make it back from her space trip, but someone else got to it first. We see Ryan write, open only in case I don't come back, on an envelope. But when we see the letter again, the sentence is written in different handwriting. On top of this, Ryan chose to leave her very important letter where anyone could find it, which wasn't exactly the smartest thing to do. Basketball Interruptions Coach Davies isn't someone who messes around, especially not in the middle of a game. But for some strange reason, cheerleaders and spectators are allowed to interrupt the players mid-game. We've seen this happen on more than one account. Like when Sophie stopped Alex in the middle of the game to tell him that she saw Leo and Haley in the driveway. A typical coach would bench their player for putting a game on hold for social matters. The Cave Bomb in Season 2, Episode 11, Kyle explains that the bomb will be strong enough to wipe out the caves and all of Greenhouse Academy. Haley, Ryan, and Marcus are stuck in a cave with a bomb that is seconds away from detonating. Leo and Daniel manage to get into the cave and take the bomb outside with them. They throw it into the air and it explodes, throwing them back. It's hard to believe that a bomb powerful enough to destroy over six miles of land didn't completely annihilate everyone near the caves and beyond. 
happened. Instead, a small explosion was shown and Leo and Daniel made it out alive. The new Brooke Brooke Osmond was portrayed by Grace Van Dien for the first two seasons, but she left the show to join the TV series The Village, which led to producers having to recast her role. So now Brooke is played by Danica Yarosh. And we're still having a hard time adjusting. Who is your favorite character from Greenhouse Academy? Which couple are you shipping? Sound off in the comments. Thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. We'll catch you next time on The Things.